Hey everybody, welcome to episode 3, yeah that sounds right, 3 of Let's Build Minecraft. I got a little bit of sheep action going on here, cause uh, I want to bring in a few new materials into the build. Um, as you can see, I remembered that you can make these uh, two by two. You should all be very proud of me. So I uh, I replenished our wood supplies between the last episode and now. So what are we at? Yeah, we almost have a full row of spruce. Got quite a bit of dark oak wood and we could do for some more oak wood but should be good for now just make that even um i've been collecting some wall and i think for what we want you know what let's just grab all of it let's just grab all of it um we got more potatoes. Throw these in the oven, in the furnace. Well, we're away. So I got a little bit of work done. I, you can see already, I got some layout work done. I didn't actually build anything, but we're working our way towards planning. I can start removing this stuff. I'm carrying around lily pads so that when I need to get up, pop one down, get up there, jump on up. I'm very good at this game. So I added this spot on top of our bar that we were working on. If you didn't see last time, we added this bar and it's still pretty empty. It's still got to be touched up. So that stuff like this is gone. But we didn't even have a roof last time, so now we do. And I got this area up here, and I do have plans for it, and I think that's what we're going to work on today. But I also worked out this area, and I got plans for right here. Uh, nothing, not a unique building, because I talked about how unique buildings are going to look... Or, specialty buildings are gonna stand out a little bit more but up here uh might be next episode and this will be two unique buildings and i'm spraying everything out instead of completing like one area like i st still gotta finish that tower because i want to get the feeling that this is a big town and i want to get spread out and then fill in the boring parts or not the boring parts but the townsy parts um i think i did this off camera i had a little post here and i think i did it i think i did it somewhere else maybe not but uh i figured we need lighting around here so i put lighting at the doors i figured this is the kind of village that would actually be using torches um, I also added some stairs to make these places look beat up. Um, yeah, I don't know. You know, I, I can do that style where you... <clears throat> excuse me. Where you uh, mix up different kinds of wood, different kinds of stone and whatever to make it, uh, the textures um, mix and whatnot. And we'll find our place in different builds. For that kind of stuff but <clears throat> for this yeah I mean just plain uh, blocks seem to work pretty well so anyways up here let's go ahead and get a crafting bench we got a little bit of excess of this so we'll use this place that over that um, I decided to put this here because if you look under there, that's the pillar from the bar. <clears throat> so what is this? This is a bit of 
a market area. And it's not huge. Uh, maybe uh, we'll see how much we can fit in here, but we might have to maybe expand it this way. <clears throat> or maybe even make a, a bigger one. You know, maybe maybe this is like the small outskirts of the town, since it is on the edge of where we're going to have a town. And we're not going to expand this way too much. We're going to mostly expand out this way. So maybe this is like a small market for this side of town, and then there's bigger, better things over there, and they get a bigger, better market. <clears throat> but I'll show you what I came up with. I need these. I need these. And I need these. I got everything except... You know what? We're running a little low on oak, so let's not use that. We got spruce for days, but let's use this. <clears throat> uh, you might have noticed I put out a video for a detailed tutorial for some planes that you can make in 1.9. Some cool little tricks that I figured out. <clears throat> it's nothing, you know, game-changing or anything, but uh, it's something that we could use eventually. I jumped down there because I wanted to see if that corner was where it needed to be. Oh. It's going to take a lot longer if we wait, and it's going to be down real soon if we don't. <laughs> <clears throat> really quick, I'll show you what I'm making Like a so, um, let's see, we got room here. Yep, nope. I say really quick, and then I can't do it fast enough to do it really quick. <sighs> So we'll go sleep. I'm really excited to get little houses and whatnot in here and make it feel like a town. I think it's coming together. Um, Whenever I build on my own, like my own worlds I've had before, I take forever to build anything. But now that I'm doing this, got a bit of a schedule and an agenda. <clears throat> I can actually get some stuff going. And I quite like the way I'm doing things. All right. Um. Sorry, I'm thinking here. Uh, I'm pretty sure that I had this differently when I came up with it, but. Oh, can't do it. Nope. Not good enough. Never played this game before. Uh, yeah, this is fine. So, we got a little booth type deal here. And let's pull this back and give whoever's working here some shade. And there would be fence right here. Very good. And right there. All right, so that's the kind of thing that we're looking at. Um, you know, a few outdoor uh, like vending areas. And also uh, this right here is going to be like an indoor store. Um, but how can we mix this up? Possibly like... Like this. If we put a little, oh, a little gray stripe right there, again some FPS hits. And I've been saying that every video, and I've been saying if you've been following along, that Optifine is not out for this version. Yeah, we can do that. 
We can also just change the top one to a different color. But this way, you know what? Uh, another idea. Let's do uh, this. I thought I had a bunch of these. Did I use them? I must have. I did. I remember using them. Make it so that a um, little bit of barrier there. Nobody getting in there. It's foolproof. Sell stuff from here. Beautiful view. Get to look in these people's little window. Make sure that they're not up to no good. Um, okay, so you can throw in a few of these. Um, gosh, I had another design. Cannot think for the life of me what it was. If I shorten this one, I wonder, well, let's see, let's, we need to extend this side out with my screws, where are you at? Right there, right there, right there, nope, right there. Going through so much spruce, but so easy to get. One of these trees is like 70 or 80 blocks, like no joke. Um, let's see. Did I have this out two blocks with this a stair? Oh, mess. I don't want to. Um, let me check. Yes, I did. I did. I need a better way up here, like for real. I wonder if, yeah. Um, let's see. What did I just say? Spruce stairs. And I need more spruce. And there's our stairs. All right, very good. So we can place these down and get a better idea of how much room we actually have. Oh, let's do what we do there. And this is not a stair. Okay, that gives us quite a bit more room, whether it's for that little shop that we're gonna have, or for these guys. So let's, I ran out of my things. Um, you know, we could even use like birch wood for these posts, make them stand out a little bit, but I don't, I used them all on stairs. That's fine though. We can even use those stairs on one of our booths. Uh, what was I making? What was fence? Fence I need sticks you don't need that many sticks um i want oak i didn't count that out so i don't know if that's right it's about right a little bit extra very good so what's monday as of me recording this Tuesday as of you guys getting the video. How are you? Um, I'm just looking at. So yeah, uh, my class has started up today. Um, started up a little bit later than a lot of other colleges. I've got a new semester. Um, Sort of excited for, I guess. I had a tough semester last here this uh, fall. 
so I'm glad we don't that I got the grays that I really struggled and try hard to get but I finally got them so now we are in a new semester both me and my wife and the classes don't look as tough but I say that every semester and they always are um, that post just looks so out of place it really does i'm gonna fix this don't worry what if we did that that looks fine maybe even one more I don't think that's necessary though. I really don't. I think that's fine. But yeah, and I don't think I've said, but I am a biology major. A little bit about me. Okay, so we could fit, let's see, they're four wide. <clears throat> so we could, one, two, three, four, Four, two, three, four, and then doorway there, maybe back way into the shop there. Okay, we got something. Now we're cooking with grease. Yeah. Um, we need at least one space. Nope. Uh, wrap around. Okay, there's one. We can make the other one out of spruce matches the floor. So I'd really rather not. I need to get acacia wood. That would be something nice to throw in here and there. Um, right there. No, not right there. That's gonna block off. Oops. Right there. Nighttime already. Time really flies when you're trying to get something done in a 30 minute video. Of course, I could always cut, but I am also a viewer of the YouTubes. And I know I like to watch people uh, build out their stuff sometimes it's good to mix both and you know i'm so worried about getting stuff actually accomplished but i know when i watch and i think a lot of people are this way i really don't notice that much when somebody doesn't get much done and I don't mind it. A lot of people just like listen, listening to them. I don't know. Maybe no one likes listening to me. I'm a doofus after all. all right. Let's get that. Let's try the two tone on this one. Um, let's just get up there. Or not. I'm so cool. That was so cool of me. This black wool is super black. <laughs> um, but I don't think it's a bad thing. Mm. You know what? I had some ideas. Let me try. How do you make banners? 
What a noob. How do you make banners? Um, is it like that? Yeah. Go run out of wool. Just make four. Maybe we can uh, dye these, but to give you an idea of something that I want to try. Um, bam, 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 and oh man. Uh, gosh, those are super white. Um, I might dye those light gray. Oh man, I have light gray. How do you? Give me. How do you? How do you? You just um like that? What do you? I never really messed around with banners, like all the patterns and stuff. I don't know. Oh, that's just Japan dot. Um, how do you make the whole thing? Would I, I bet I had to use gray wool. Um, you dang fool. Give it. Do I gotta break it or do I, like, oh, mess. Oh, mess. <laughs> how do you break these dang things? Oh, you do. I thought, you know, I was just, Trying to hit them because I swear I just hit the last one. Um, all right, now I got a bunch of banners that I do not want too bright for me. Oh gosh, I got so much junk and I want it all. I don't know how. Don't know how I need all this stuff. Um, oh gosh, give me sticks. No. Good. Give me those back, cause I'm gonna need them. What if? Um, uh, what happens if? Put that there. You know, I kind of like it. I don't know if I like it as much from that view though. Please don't go over. Thank you. Thank you. I think. I think I do like it that way. All right. So like a little bit of drapery. Really feel like you're enclosed in now. Protected from the elements. I like it. I like it. I don't know about you, I do. I don't know about you. You don't know about me. And we can maybe splice this one up later, but I got like just enough wool for me to mess up and have enough for all this. Um, Let's use up some of these chests. Um, you know what? Put that one over that stupid log. Put this one. This guy's got great spot. Everybody see him right there. Right. I feel like you want to be. Let's keep him away from that guy. Don't want to get too close. And then that doesn't make any sense, does it? But this does. There we go. A little bit of a gap, but nothing I'd be too worried about. This guy's got a nice roomy area. All right, let's place this just to make some inventory room. Maybe even put some stuff in it. All right. Um. Now I'm gonna build up this building and get back to you when I have a little bit of progress and we're back and this is what I got 
finished up that building there. Not too much, but that pretty much winds up our little marketplace area. Um, you know, hmm. we could add another booth here. And I might do that off camera. But I got the store here. We got a flat roof. And <laughs> just looking at it, I'm thinking about all the creepers that are going to spawn up there. And I've been terrified of night. I've been sleeping as soon as I can see a sun around there. But hopefully if they're up there, we'll see them before they see us. Inside here, we got a main door right here. You know, you walk through this path. Um, you know, it's, it's the, I guess you can see that one. But if you're over here, it's the one that you see. It's out in the open. The back door that leads to storage is over there. And I'll show you that right here. We can maybe put shelves, uh, not shelves, but um, chests in here and use it as a small storage and maybe start to phase out our use of that hole over there. And then up here, um, something I really like that I did in here is this wall that's not a full wall. It gives you an idea of how big the entire building is and it's not too claustrophobic. I like the feeling that gives. That's just there for separating. Uh, and then I put down these these beams up there. Something I did in that room right there. So, yeah, I like how the inside came out. Um, we're gonna have to. I'm gonna have to like make a sugarcane farm and beat up a bunch of cows and get a bunch of bookcases and decorate the in uh yeah decorate the interiors maybe put like some bookcases and shelves right here to just make it look like he has wares or items or whatever he's selling there uh i don't know put something here here We'll figure out interior. We'll like mass farm the things that we need for interior and go from building to building. Back here shouldn't be too hard, just chests. Um, it's not like it has to look pretty because only the owner should be there. Um, You know, while we're at it, let's just go ahead. Um, Make this really quick. I do not have enough wool on me right now. Um, trying to decide exactly where I want it, right oh, there. Get rid of that, get rid of this. I'm gonna put, um, I'm gonna put, I think I have a way to cover this. I could put the trap door here and then that's not a trap door. I could put the trap door here and it would kind of cover it. Um, I could put the chest there, but that doesn't make a ton of sense. I might also change this out for acacia or something if we go and find acacia because there's just too much of this, I think. Um, We can get, you know what? Let's change it up with the fence. Make this one look a little bit different. It's nothing too noticeable, but I put my wool in here. Oh, uh, five. Ugh. Um, I'm just thinking I could just make this one really dark for now. I don't exactly have a bunch of dye and stuff. So maybe we'll revisit this. I do have like a town flag in mind. Colors that we can maybe use and they're kind of bright. The reason I haven't been using bright colors is I really do see this as a, well, yeah, I see it as a desolate town. Cause when you see Riften and Lake Town, which these are, or this is pretty much inspired from. Uh, they're pretty uh, plain as far as colors and 
even the scenes in like Lake Town in the in the Hobbit movies, uh, just to remove all coloring basically, make it look really foggy. But I don't know if I like that one. But we'll worry about that. Um, I'm thinking about if maybe we could have a window here. But I also don't like that's basically looking into uh this guy like. You what what are you selling? What you got? Phone right here. Hey guy, what you got? What are your prices? I'll beat them. But <laughs> um, yeah, that's it. Uh, I I like what we're what we're doing here. This area now, just looking right here, it's starting to look full, and it's just two little segments. We start to add stuff back here soon, and down here, and. It, I think it's going to look like it has a lot of depth to it. And I didn't even look at it from back here. I think it looks fine. Yeah. So yeah, it's getting nighttime. So uh, before the monsters get me, uh, I'll see you next time. And leave a like and subscribe and uh, leave a comment because uh, I like... What in the world? Look how easily I'm, I'm distracted. I'm missing a block there. Uh, what was I saying? Oh yeah, leave me a comment because uh, I like talking to you guys. So, bye!